Welcome Brawlers, I'm Taylor and I'm back with another video breaking down everything Bakugan. This video is all about factions, card types, and deck building guidelines. There's a lot of stuff to go over, so let's dive right in. Okay, factions. What's a faction? Well, a faction is a group of Bakugan based on similar characteristics and attributes. There are six factions, each with their unique strengths and abilities. The factions you choose for your team will determine the style and strengths of your deck. The six factions are Pyrus, Aquos, Ventus, Darkus, Heos, and Aurelis. Whichever faction you choose, the ability cards you use during a battle must match the faction of your Bakugan. For example, if you're using an Aquos, Pyrus, and Darkus Bakugan, then your deck can only include Aquos, Pyrus, and Darkus ability cards. There's a lot of info about factions, and we can't cover it all in this video, so we've dedicated specific videos breaking down each faction. You can check those out by clicking the link below. Okay, next we're talking about card types. If you want to be a master brawler, you're going to need to know about all the different card types and how they factor into your battling strategy. There are two main card types, character and ability shown here. Each Bakugan comes with a character card, which shows its B power and damage rating. On the front side of a character card, you'll see a bunch of different bunch symbols. Of different this is the faction symbol. At the top right is the Baku core symbol. Here on the bottom, you'll see the damage rating and B power. If the card provides a special ability, this will be shown below the B power. And in the very bottom right is the set icon. To create your 40 card deck, you can include the following types of ability cards. Action, Flip, Evo, and Hero. Just like character cards, there's a bunch of symbols and information on ability cards. An ability card will let you know the card name or special ability, the energy cost, from which faction it belongs, the card type, and an overall description of the ability. For example, an action card allows you to perform a one-time action during play. Once played, you place the card in the discard pile. Flip cards cannot be played from your hand like an action card. A flip card can only be played when it is discarded from the top of your deck. For example, if you're taking damage from an opponent and you flip over a flip card that can stop the opposing Bakugan's faction, you can prevent further damage from happening as long as you have enough energy left to play it. An Evo card will evolve or upgrade one of your Bakugan to a more powerful version that will replace your Bakugan for the rest of the game or until an opponent can destroy it. Remember though, Evo cards can only be played on their matching character card. Hero cards act as support cards that will remain in play each round unless they're destroyed by an opponent. And one final rule about cards. You can't have more than three copies of one card in your deck. Sorry brawlers, that's just the rule. I know this is a ton of info, but now that you have an understanding of the card types, factions, and what goes into building a deck, we can dive into the good stuff. Gameplay. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give us a like and a share, and be sure to subscribe to get the latest info coming your way from the Bakuverse. See you on the Hyde Matrix, Bakugan Brawl!